And we're back with more Night in the Woods. Hello. Woo. It is night. Hello. Hello. It is night. It's there are woods next to us. my building. Woods are not till several, several tens of miles. I mean, from there my are house. woods pretty close to me. Oh, here we go. Hell yeah. Um, all right. So, uh, I Rain. think. So, Hannah, you're the fox. I know Andrew's definitely. Or not Andrew. Uh, DJ's definitely the bird. Seb is the bear. I guess Rip. I'll take Colleen the gator. Oh, but this is going to be a little bit tricky. Hannah, I think you should actually focus on being Pastor Kate still for this. Okay. Um, and then, Fane, you could be the fox lady. Hey! Damn. There'll be children here! And this is a historic church. That's half empty. Yeah, it's your job to fix, not ours population drain in this region you have to know this place will never be full again we have the space and we have the people who need space we have resources and we have pro poverty and not in some far off place or some big city right here right across the street Kate it's our number one job right now. Oh, I'm going to point out, he didn't say Kate. He said Katie, like he's talking Katie. down to her. Katie, it's our number one job right now. To bring businesses into this, into town. Businesses means jobs, and jobs mean people. We have to do what we can to get the attention of the market. And having half and having a half dead church stack full of bums. Thanks for your time. We'll see you for the vote tomorrow night. Thank you, Kate. You have a good heart, Kate. Thank you all for coming. Marvel's now taking over for me as voice acting. She has stolen my seat. Ah. <laughs> I was eating something. No. Uh, full day. Some days you need grace more than others. Was this all about Bruce? It was. It is. Whatever. It's our it's out of our hands now. But there are better hands than mine. Hmm. Anyway, how are you, May? Eh. <laughs> Sound serious. I guess. So like Things have been rough lately. I can see that. What seems to be the trouble? I think I met God. What? It was a dream, or... I don't think it was a dream. I don't think it was a dream. I'm not even sure if it was a dream. I feel like, actually, the second answer feels more like how... May's dream felt. Well, I mean, the other thing is, don't forget, the god that we met claimed, I am not a god. I have asked, what is a god? And these people tell me what a god is, and I am not him, for he is not here. Uh, yeah. I... I will abstain. So, okay, I need to hear um, the votes, then. Who said it was a dream? I don't think okay. anyone said it was a dream. Alright, so it, it sounds like everyone was agreeing, then not a dream. Got it. Oh, wow. That happens, right? Or it, like, happened. Sure. 
Can you tell me about it? I was in the desert. It was like the shore. Hmm. I was in the desert. It was like the shore. Yeah, it was... It was something that was generic enough. Like, I remember hill, but like... There wasn't really much other defining features. I remember it being more like a forest, actually. Well, that's not what May remembers. Uh, desert. Yeah, desert. Okay. As far as I could see. We're like... All that was left of the world. What's well, bits of wood and sand? I was wandering through it, but I was like drawn to something, and it came up over this. What do you call a hill made of sand? A dune. A dune. Yeah, a dune. And there was God. Just sitting there, up on another hill. Yeah, I remember the hills. Or dune, or whatever. And just hanging out? Yeah. Seems like they were really into just hanging out. Did they say anything? Yeah. They, like, didn't care. They were kind of a jerk. Uh, they didn't care. Yeah, they, like, didn't care. Mm -hmm. They didn't care if you were there? No, I mean, they didn't care. In general. They went on and on about how annoyed they were. That people kept coming to them with questions. And annoyed that anyone thought they were God to begin with. <laughs> well, I don't think that was God, then. Why? If, if something tells you it isn't God, you should probably believe it. No, what I mean is that the thing we call God isn't God. It's just a thing. And it doesn't care. Hmm. They keep talking about how oh, nothing matters or this giant hole. I, nothing matters. Nothing matters. Oh. Oh. Fane? Fane? Are you still here? Ah. Uh, yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah. Hi. Um. Yeah, what are the things again? Sorry. Nothing matters. Is it again a stalemate? Yep. Yeah, that's oh why. I, that's when I turn to you. <laughs> like the universe is ending, and everything mm. is being forgotten. And that yeah. sounds very lonely. Have you been feeling lonely lately? Yes. No. Oh, yes. Yes. She's been clearly depressed, like, this whole day. Have you been feeling very hungry lately? <laughs> Always. So is everyone okay if I say yes? Yes. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yep. I had this problem when I was in high school. And I did something really bad. You probably heard about it. Your mom has mentioned it. Yeah, I figured. Well, since then. There's this deep down loneliness. Been there for years. Since, well, just been a long time. I've been there. I mean, I'm there all the time. I think that's where if we open ourselves up God can enter our lives most effectively. I guess. I don't think I believe in God anymore. Hmm. 
I guess. I guess. I guess. Yeah. Sometimes that's the best you've got. Yeah. I feel like that's maybe not a good enough answer. Is that a good enough answer for anyone? Faith is a process. You have to keep getting up and choosing to go on. Do you really think there's a god? Like, literally someone up there listening? Is that something you completely believe in? Believe? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe. Oh. On my best days, I think I do. But there are times where I don't. But but you stand up there every Sunday. And tell people you do. And even you're not sure. It's your job to believe. Well, I think it's more my job to serve others. But you're lying to people. Ow. You stand up there and tell people to believe. And something you 100% believe in, you don't 100% believe in yourself. Maybe you're right, me. W would you like us to pause so you can finish eating, Sam? A little, yeah. Alright. We'll pause then for a little bit. I'm sorry, I'm eating soup. Yeah, I know, this is a very serious scene, so like, you go in soup soup, I'm like, ah. Alright, we're back from our break. Alright. Maybe you're right, me. And maybe I should get up there every week. And give some sort of tally of how much I believe that week. But who would that help? But you're a pastor. And you can't tell me whether or not God is up there. Whether anyone is watching. Anyone who gives a shit. No, but... Then what is the point of you? And like, look, May is taking this very rough. Mm-hmm. I have to go. Okay. Yeah, everything that's been going on for May recently has been challenging her in a whole slew of things. Mm -hmm. I'll talk to Mom later. I want to see. Can I go into this back room now? Please. Why no, must no you show room. me that there's a room if I can't go in there? <laughs> it's because May can't actually read, and those are all books. But the thing is, so here's the thing. Like, in the original uh, version of the game, we couldn't even see what was that room. And now no, they I show us... Wait, so it must be a layer thing. I thought I remembered seeing the books. I, I wait, remember wait, wait, why are the... Okay, I, I'm confused because on my on my side, I don't know why the gap between the books are oh, flashing yeah, for me. They are definitely shaky books. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I thought I remembered back in the original one having like the shakiness of the books. I don't remember that, but maybe. Shaky books. We'll see. Um, Eventually they'll upload them and you guys can check, so... Right. Hey, hun. Are you still having headaches? Yeah, but then being out and about helps. Fresh air. Thanks for visiting me here, hun. It brightens my day. Feels weird being... Feels weird being here today. Like, there's so much empty space. Come on Sunday. It's full, then. I bet it is. Sorry you have to work because we have money problems. Me. I've always had a job. This is just another one. Gotta get back to work, sweetie. As I read my See ya, momers. See ya, daughters. Aww. <laughs> nice. I think it's really sweet too. We're we're kind of watching May break, but like we're watching the world around her that she's been becoming friends with, like be like, oh hey, you need us now. 
Yeah, I mean, that's the thing. is like It's interesting to see how May's world has shifted. Where she's kind of getting her like faith in reality just kind of tested. Well, the dudes in her dreams are now just hanging out on the top ceilings. Uh, so no. This is... This is Salem, and he's not from her dream. Still up here? I mean, I left and went to work, and so forth since we met. Hmm. Is that a fiddle? It's a violin. That's like the same thing, right? It's a violin, I assure you. <laughs> Rude. I just met someone else playing by themselves. Really? Yeah, across town in the abandoned building by the Click Clack. They have one of those big saxophones. Hmm. I just thought it was an interesting coincidence. Small town. <laughs> I feel, <laughs> although I feel it is kind of related to the dream, not gonna lie. <laughs> it is a little bit, but like, they're not from her dream is what I was pointing no. out. No, no. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna... There we go. Kitty. There's a top cat. Ooh, top cat. It's your people, May. I'm queen of Possum Springs. I'll eat you. I am late. <laughs> the town limits. These pigeons, they don't give an F about that. Uh, I about rule that over everything. Hey, kid. What you up to? Hey, adult. Nothing. Sounds good. Was gonna go down to the tracks. Do you want to come? Yep. Sounds good, actually. Oh, good, good, good. Let's go. Totally, let's. My friend Casey used to come out here and smoke. I used to smoke when I was younger. I'm allergic, or... Oh, really? I'm allergic. I'm allergic. <laughs> I'm allergic. I was gonna say oh, really, but I'm already uploaded. Well, my friend B does it, ar it around me anyway. She blows it right into my face and says start puffing up. <laughs> she literally has a lollipop. Chill. How long did you do it for? Okay, it was once. I was younger, though. I was 12. Good age to quit. <laughs> I could vape. You could vape. I'm not gonna vape. Probably a good idea. Um, so do you remember the thing we squished on the tracks last time? Uh, yeah! What are we doing? Gonna make a flatter? Kind of, but no. You'll see. I'm gonna pick a new thing to squish him with. Alright then. You know what we don't have around here? A taco place? Serial killers. Oh yeah, hmm. I mean, I vote for us getting a taco place first, but... <laughs> yeah, we never get around to getting our own serial killer. You ever think about murdering someone? What? Like, okay, so... A few longest nights ago, I went to Bright Harbor with my aunt and cousin. And we went on the subway. And like, there's no railing down there above the tracks. And I had this sudden urge to, like, shove someone off it. It was weird, and I felt guilty about it for a long time. But, like, I didn't actually do it, so... I mean, is that normal? I think that's pretty normal. I guess you actually did try to kill someone. <laughs> that was different. No, I didn't. That was different. That was, that different. was different, yeah. How? That was, like, not planned. And I wasn't trying to kill him. It was just a thing that happened. So, yeah. 
It wasn't like my first step. On the way to Serial of Killer Dumb. <laughs> Sorry. So terrifying. <laughs> so when we first played this game, um, we were playing with <laughs> Rosie, and Rosie would freak out every time we would get to one of these scenes. Oh yeah, it's cool. You know what I like? Tacos. Pictures of the meteor that killed the dinosaurs. Where the dinosaurs are watching in the sky. Oh yeah, that's like every single picture of the that meteor. Weird. Wonder if they knew. Yeah, each time the train passed, it just messed up Rosie. Yeah, he was like, ah. Someday I will upload our first playthrough of Night in the Woods. Yes. Okay, 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 okay. Let's see what we got. Yay! Oh god, your little dudes are... It like hurts my soul. It speaks. The art speaks, May. It calls my name. Uh... That was cool. Yeah, it was. I gotta get going. Things are, like, hectic right now. Oh, what's up? Uh, jeez. Just, like, be careful, okay? How so? Like, go home at dark. There's some bad stuff going on. Like what? Oh god, I don't even know where to start. Just, like, be careful. Alright. Thanks for the warning. About whatever you're warning me about. Don't mention it. I do love that, that May's also going around warning as many like, young people as she can. Leaders! <laughs> it hurts the soul. <laughs> this combined like a couple of her dudes. <laughs> ah yes, I've seen Full Metal Alchemist. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god, that hurts. <laughs> that oh. hurts so much. <laughs> ah. As as the colloquial term is, woof. God no. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Why? Alright, so we got all of our grandchildren. You no. Know, if you showed that scene to me, then maybe. I said like a small child. <laughs> Just stop. Seriously, there's no bathroom in here. And none outside this room. Do they poop in the this dresser? Oh god. Do they poop in a bucket? Oh jeez, what if I stumble across the poop bucket? There are unanswered questions here. Seriously. <laughs> Wonder if it's a guy or a gal. They're probably pretty old. No one young cares about the saints. Or church. It's gonna be weird in like 30 years. When all the churches are empty. Oh, been a pizza place. Sit in the pews and eat pizza. Gotta come up with a pun. Buy a pizza in church. The Holy Crust? Oh, that's a good one. That is a good one. Wait, Holy pepperoni! <laughs> I'd say there's a fun story about, I think, a friend of ours. Apparently, um, when he, you know, was like, well, it's a not so pizza mass. Do you remember this story? Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Apparently back when, um... They first started, like, Vatican II, they would do, like, pizza masses. Yeah, they would do things like pizza masses to get... Yeah, the whole... 
<laughs> promote community. <laughs> Excellent. Yep. I could sleep in this bed. And whoever lives here would never know. They go to sleep tonight. I don't know where someone else was just there. Under their sheets. On their pillow. Mwahahaha. I could also, like, be helpful. I could make their bed when they don't. This doesn't have to be creepy. I was gonna say, it's like, and you don't know if they have, like, lice or anything like that. <laughs> I wonder if whoever lives here knows I've been here. I feel like we have some relationship. Like, I'm a ghost. And I'm haunting them. I should, like, move something. Just to let them know someone cares. Enough to visit them. Okay, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> that would be the creepiest thing ever. Because, yeah, think about it. If you lived in, like, a second floor floor apartment in a floor that's locked to the outside how did somebody get in your apartment because mm -hmm. knowing that a girl climbed up fucking like street lights and power lines to get to your apartment does not make me feel any better nope s and s and f i love all the like graffiti that's all the way up here This does mean that other people have been up here, too, which is interesting. Yes. And there are rats are located in really bloody. Yep. Little rat army. Oh, he's by himself today. Yeah, because his friend quit, remember? Oh, I know, but there was the other, like, owl lady. Yeah, there was another person. Coffee. Cigarettes. Cigarettes. Take access to go to uh... B. Yeah, uh, but today is the second day of part three, which means I can talk to B, and we'll get some interesting dialogue here. Hey, B. Hey. You're right. You seem down. Oh, it's nothing. Stuff. You want to talk about it? Nah. Okay. Oof. What are you up to today? Wandering around town? Or whatever you want to do. Wandering. I can only do whatever he wants to do. Oh, uh, I don't care. I'm abstaining. I mean, I only got two votes, so. Whatever you want to do. It's cool. I'm busy. And Greg and Angus have my car tonight. So, I'm stuck home anyway. Oh, okay. See what they're up to, maybe? They're going somewhere or another. I'm not. <laughs> oh, what? wandering around town? Have fun. Okay then. So yeah, uh, since we're on the Greg route, we cannot hang out with B on this night. <laughs> we have to have a Greg and Angus event instead. Cool. No. But you know what? I think we can mess around with that next time. Say goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Bye.